TWCC kids, Miss Melissa here. I just wanted to share an object lesson with you today, but I do want to say I miss you all so very, very much. But get ready. Are you ready? Let's get into it. So today we're going to talk about fear. How many of you have ever experienced fear? I know I have. I think we all have, right? But with Jesus living inside of us, guess what? He's the one that can help push the fear out of us. And today I'm going to show you what it kind of looks like. Are you ready? So this clear jar represents our bodies. This is us, okay? And the baking soda represents the fear in our hearts. And the vinegar represents Jesus. So, so many times we get so fearful, right, of things. Maybe it's fearful of telling people about Jesus. Maybe it's fearful of getting sick. Maybe it's fearful of the dark. We get so many things we're afraid of, right? But when we have Jesus in our hearts and living inside of us, he comes and he pushes all of the fear out of us. And do you see it bubbling, all of the bubbles coming out? Well, that's what Jesus does to us, is he comes and he pushes all of the fear out of us and we no longer have fear, right? But that doesn't mean we're never gonna be fearful because we're human and we live in a world full of sin and fear. But the wonderful thing is, is that we have Jesus living inside of us. And in his word, Isaiah 41, 10, it says, fear not for I am with you. Be not dismayed for I am your God. I will strengthen you, I will help you, and I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. So you see how it's all clear now? Well, that's what Jesus does, is he comes and he pushes out all of our fear, and look it, we become clear again, right? And I have a challenge for you this week, is if you're two to four years old, all you have to do is memorize, fear not, for I am with you, Isaiah 41.10. And if you're five years and up, you guys get to memorize the full scripture. And parents, if you can record your children on Friday, having them saying the scripture and tag the word Fresno, we'd love to see it. Well, that's all I have for us today. I love you guys and I'll see you soon. Bye.